Hello Libra and welcome to your monthly reading. This is a general reading for the month of May 2020. Libra. Nothing came forward. Let's see. Okay, Libra. Hmm. Bad. Okay. Libra, there is a focus on... I want to say taking your power back it's almost like this energy that i see is like what didn't kill um kill you only made you stronger so i'm picking up that for some of you for some of you it's uh really a focus on you taking back your power uh so to speak okay money coming through some of you already went through a tower moment and this is okay we all went through a tower moment but this is really showing up here to love it could be connected to love there is some negativity here. This is secrets. It's like there is this intense energy here. This can indicate um, an ongoing karmic cycle with someone. Secrets. Someone's um, hiding some secrets or, you know, it just surrounds you. Hidden, 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 hidden. I like this. Okay, I like this. Because this is rewards, money coming in, and new people, new experiences on your journey ahead. So I really do like that, but it's going to take some time to get here to end or to manifest this, okay? For some of you, a female is going to be very important. And this is someone who is like a VIP. This is also the stone of justice agreements. Um, this could be um, a female, I feel, is like either she could be an attorney um, a VIP, um, or someone who knows what they are doing. They may be, um, of assistance to you. Okay. So that's one thing I'm seeing. This could be dealing with important legal documents or some kind of agreement. Okay. So that's one thing I do see here for some of you feeling trapped in some kind of agreement. Love is kind of showing up a lot in a few places here. You have a tower here too, lifestyle, uh, jealousy surrounds you here too, but putting more sunnier and, um, let's say, more action into some things as well that you want to create and manifest, okay? So that too, here is lifestyle, home, and people that are close to you, frustrations. Things have not been so clear. There's been some uh, kind of deception, the unknown, some people or situations, some things have been kept from you. Love is showing up here as well. So that's really coming in as an important factor. Then we got the stone all isolated here. So I am seeing for some of you, you're going to have to review matters of the heart, okay, relationships, there is an imbalance with um, some kind of relationship, there's not enough either, um, the chemistry's not there, or something is fading and leaving, and a lot of you are getting more clarity and realization in that, and that could be just in any relationship in general, the balance and give and take is not there, either you love someone and they're not uh, reciprocating, or it's vice versa, that's another way I can look at this as well, so it's like I do see you feeling trapped in a certain situation. It, it is directly connected to the heart for a lot of you. Now, counting your blessings is going to be very important. Changes are occurring in uh, what you do most of the day, which this could be career, uh, work, job, all of that. You can manifest a lot, Libra. You really can. A lot of things are just going to work out for you when you kind of let things go. There is going to be either epiphanies or some very important news or official news coming through too. I do see it's going to get you to wonder. It's going to bring you some kind of clarity and you being tr uh, trusting where trusting the universe that where you're being led. Okay, there there is that energy that is showing up. Okay, you still have to work on some certain situations here. All right, I do see that it's like there's a return of energy here too. A lot of you could be connecting with. Uh, I don't know. It's like, it's almost karmic. It's like karmic loves, okay? It's like there is um, either kind of soul connection from the past. Um, I do see very creative energy when you take your time, think things through, okay? That's going to bring you some kind of success and victory. And movement ahead. So I do see that, all right? Now, I do see you're, you really need to gather all information, um, facts, 
Watch out for any miscommunications before you make any important decision because I do some do see some of you are going to make some very important and vital decision too. I see that for some of you very final. It's not for all of you. That's going to be officially final with something and you're going to stand your ground. You're going to get through something. Whatever it is in your life, you're going to push forward. Now, for some of you, be prepared. This could be you love coming in, too. That's going to be very rewarding or you love love. For some, this could be official, uh, um, officializing a relationship. This can be like a uh, about, talks about marriage, okay? Um, spiritually connecting is so, so important as well. Uh, manifestation is very important, but make sure you do not manifest the negative, okay? And make sure that you know exactly what you want to manifest because it's almost like there's not enough clarity. And then just say you don't know, a, just say you like someone or I'm going to give you an example and you want this person to be part of your life so bad, so bad, but you're not sure. And this could be a maniac, Okay, and then you're manifesting and yeah, it comes real, but then it's going to be your worst nightmare. So be careful what you want to manifest. There is the mood uh, confusion here and negativity here. You don't want to go into a negative cycle because there are secrets around. Okay, there are secrets. Some uh, There is things that are unknown here too. Okay, this could be some secrets being revealed, but again, manifesting and thinking things carefully through. Okay. Uh, new people, new experiences really are going to be coming through. There's going to be a lot of adjustments in uh, lifestyle and the way you live as well. So there's going to be um, some kind of movement. This could be even someone unexpectedly somehow coming to visit. So I do see some changes there as well. Even with work, okay, there's some things that is going to re recommend for you to change. Maybe it's scheduling your hours differently. Uh, making um, adjustments and moves. I don't know. I'm just seeing there's some changes with uh, whatever you do most of the day, or this is career and uh, work. So I do see that. Tapping into the things that you care about the most is really coming through as well. And there is rewards and money coming in. Okay? And this is with different types of energies. This is like, you can highly manifest it, but it's going to take a lot of work for others. This is... Uh, it's in ways that uh, is kind of unexpected, okay? So that's another thing I'm saying. This could be someone who's got different kinds of energies around, you know. Um, it's almost something you're not used to. Different. There's a sense of some kind of thing foreign or different here as well, okay? Well, Libra, that was your reading for the month of May. I hope you have a wonderful month, and I'll catch you back next month for your next reading. Until then, all the best, and bye for now.